but uh, I'm I'm glad I pulled off a great a great submission. Do you feel like people haven't been giving you the respect you deserve? Like you said, yes, two losses, but to the champ, to the interim champ. I mean, do you feel like people maybe forgot about how good you are? Yeah, people, you know, like I I, I don't care much, you know, because people get a short memory, you know, when it comes people remember you more. Uh, of your last performance, as always. Unfortunately, in MMA, people remember, you can come off three, five losses in a row. If you won a good one, oh, he's back. But, you know, I know how it is. I've been in that position before, and I'm just, you know, thinking one step at a time, you know. I think um, I might not get a, a everybody's approval, and I know it's, it's hard to get everybody to praise you, but, you know, I'm just going to keep doing my work doing what I love and being, you know, health and taking care of my body, being able to support my family. That's what I'm looking for. All right, the last thing for me as far as Leon, what, what do you see in him? Does he, does he compare to somebody that you fought before? Does he do something better that you haven't seen before? I mean, overall, what, what's your impression of him? I mean, he's a tough guy, you know. Uh, seven win streak is not easy. And, you know, I'm taking him really seriously. You know, he's a uh, athletic guy, young younger than me and I know he you know he's he's trying to get a crack on that belt you know a crack on that title shot but I'm doing so you know I'm, I'm on the mission I know I have what it takes to beat him and it will be it will be a good fight man you know I, I fight well against tall four tall guys I have a history and we'll see and I, I'm glad he's think I'm done and I'm not gonna be even close to 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 give him a good match but uh, but different than him, I know his stuff, and I, I prepare really well. Can you speak to the mastery? Because he did tell us that, you know, after he beat you, he went right to the title. Yeah, uh, we'll see, you know. I uh, think he's overlooking me a little bit, but as always, my all my past opponents, they do that. And But once they get there with me, it's a different story. You know, uh, it's a 5 rounds fight. Uh, I know what I'm capable of, and I know who fights for me, and, man, I'm all in on this. You know, if I'm looking for the finish, I'm going, you know, uh, throwing my heavy bombs, going aggressive. If I can finish it before, it would be great, but if not, I'm ready to go with distance too. So you want to stay on the bank for sure. Oh, yeah, man, you know, all day. I don't, I never, you know, shy away, or as always, you know. Uh, I know he's a guy that likes to stand too. And, you know, I'm going to use my experience, you know, put on, put on everything together like, like I did with Kevin Lee. You know, I know I have a bigger arsenal than him. You know, I got my takedowns. I got my, my punches, my kicks, my ground game. And, you know, my, my, my game on the bottle, too. And we'll see. It'll be a good, it'll be a good fight. Yeah, uh, that's why, you know, the, the division is kind of crazy right now. So many going on, and champions hurt right now. And I thought Kobe would fight uh, would fight Usman. Now Kobe's facing Lawler. And Masvidal beat uh, uh, Askren. And so I, I just got to keep active, you know. I know uh, a victory is always good to put you, you know, to, to bring your confidence back and like, you know, uh, the fight with Kevin Lee was a very, very risky fight. And I won, I finished him. And this one, Leon is, is a coming up guy. He's ranking number 10 or 11, I think. And, but of course, man, our victories always count good, you know, it's good for you, good for your record. And, but uh, I think it's, it's, it's a good step forward, you know, it's good for me to be active as well. Yeah, you know, like like I always say, you know, I don't I don't step on the octagon to do extra hour. You know, I always trying to go there and I uh, get out as soon as possible. You know, if I get the finish, great. If not, uh, you know, if it goes distance, I'm okay with that too. As long as long as I get the win, uh, I'm happy with. Yeah, I hope so, man. You know, uh, I, ju 
just as long as I'm healthy, you know, in the good, you know, uh, motivated. You know, when I got this call, I was 800 miles away from home. I was in Utah, Kendall, with my son. And when Dana, you know, called me, I said, hey, Dana, let me digest this. You know, I was on the, on the, <laughs> on the campsite, you know, in the middle of nowhere. And I said, okay, told my boy, let's drive back home. And then we drove 800 miles, and I saw my fight camp. I mean, uh, how, like, how long were you supposed to be there? How, how, like, how many days did you cut it short? Did you, like, leave right then? No, I was, I was there for five days already, oh. and I still have two more nights. And so we, we had one more night, then we left. Um, I think I got, the, I, got, I got the call Friday, and I slept there Friday, Saturday, and drove back Sunday. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What did your son say? Is he like, yeah, let's go? Or yeah, let's like, go. Oh, he no. said, let's go, because we had a good time. We already were there like for five days already, and and I explained to him like uh, I don't I don't put uh, work in the front of my family. You know, my family comes first, and I told him so. Dad's gonna fight now on July 20. I'm gonna be busy now on fight camp, and after that, before I go back to school, we're gonna be able to do another nice fun trip. So he's get back to, I think to school in August, I think, or September. And so we're still gonna have time to have one more good break. What's the What's the trip? You have it planned yet? Maybe we we'll go Brazil. I don't know. Like uh, my last time there was March last year, but my family hasn't been there. I think it'll be two years, and I miss I miss I miss Brazil too. You know, have a good good time by the beach. You know, eat some Brazilian food. Yeah, you know, uh, I've been I've been training hard wrestling for the past 18 months to uh, two years of my life because I've been fighting a lot of wrestlers back to back: Kobe, Usman, Kevin Lee. So my wrestling is there already. Uh, I think uh, with Kobe and Usman, I don't know, man. It's a fight, you know. I, I was on my day when you when you're not on your night, you know, things didn't work out, you know. Uh, but uh, uh, yeah, I know, like my my wrestling. I know I have more weapons than than Leon to beat to to win this fight. I know that uh, I'm a better fighter. I got more experience. You know, I I had a lot of ups and downs on UFC, and now I'm I'm I, I'm on my you know I'm I'm on the top. You know, I'm, I'm climbing to the top again. I've been on the top before, and I hope uh, I always praise God that you know uh, that He give me another 